Hello, Kasaya. This is Mary, your essential oil mama here in Kasaya Tribe. So today, I am going to talk about an oil and its benefits and how to properly use it. So today, I am going to talk about, ta Copaiba. So Copaiba came with your uh, premium starter kit. And a lot of people don't really know what the oil is for because uh, some people ask me, like, I don't smell anything in Kupaiba. So, yes, you're right. It doesn't really have a lot of scent in it. Some people say it's kind of pungent and earthy and spicy, but a lot of people actually don't smell a lot of things in Kupaiba. Uh, so, Kupaiba came from a Brazilian tree and um, Kupaiba is very rich in beta caryophyllin. And uh, so uh, copaiba is good for uh, when you just need, when you, when you feel like you're so tired and you feel like you can, sometimes when you're overly tired, it's, it's even harder to relax. So this is something that's good to diffuse. You're not really going to smell anything when you diffuse it. It really helps promote relaxation. So it's going to um, put you in a much, much more mellow mood. And um, Copaiba is also good for uh, relaxing not just uh, your state of mind, but also your body. So it's something that I like adding to a massage oil because it does help relax the muscles. So um, post-workout, it's something that's also good to apply so that you're not going to feel a lot of pain. Um it's also something that's really, really good for the skin because um, it makes your skin happy. It stimulates collagen and elastin production. So, wow, it's actually a very powerful oil. So, how do I use it? Yes, I can diffuse it. I like diffusing it with um, lavender. So, this is lavender essential oil and I like um, putting that together with copaiba. So, maybe like uh, three drops each in your diffuser and you diffuse it and you will you will notice that um, you actually feel a lot more uh, relaxed than when you're diffusing lavender alone. Uh, so, uh, I also like using it um, topically for muscle, as a muscle relaxant. I like using it with the pan away. So, uh, last week, I hurt my back. And it was so painful, I can hardly move. So what I did was um, I, I rubbed like a, a, a little bit of um, pan away on my lower back. And then I waited like two minutes and then I topped that with copaiba. Because copaiba is like a magnifier oil. So it kind of like helps um, the other oil that you are using um, better. So it works better and it works faster. And wow, just like two days, like all the stiffness on my lower back is gone. So wow, amazing, huh? And uh, for the ladies, when you get your uh, monthly period and you get cramps. So uh, what I use for discomfort, I use Clary Sage. So this is the first oil that I, apl I apply on my abdominal area. And then again, uh, it's called the layering technique. I wait like a minute or two and then I top that with copaiba. And it, it actually helps me very, very much. So for the skin, I use it the same way. I have, I, I do like some face rolling and um, when I do that, I like applying it with a carrier oil. And uh, when your skin feels very, very dry, uh, copaiba is actually something that's very good to use because it helps hydrate the skin. So when your skin is oily, um, I would uh, advise that you stay away from applying copaiba directly into your skin because it's going to make your skin look a lot oilier. So when your skin is dry, that's when you use it. For your skin so the same way for um, your hair when your scalp is too oily don't use copaiba but when your scalp is dry and itchy it's something that's good to apply to massage into your scalp before you actually take a shower maybe like take a little bit of coconut oil uh, put a few drops of copaiba in there and you just massage it through your scalp and then you wait like a few minutes like maybe a good 30 or 45 minutes and do stuff first and then you shower that off and you will notice that your scalp actually um, stop itching because it's not going to feel too dry anymore. So if you have any more questions about Copaiba, just shoot me a message and I'm here to answer your questions. Thank you, Kasaya.